this is somewhat of a split. There is a, the primary bedroom down this hall. Over to the left is the living room. We will see that shortly. And then near the front door, we have two bedrooms. Separating two bedrooms is the guest full bathroom. Let's go see the front bedroom first. Uh, the cellar still has you know a few things out, so just overlook that. Everybody's always concerned about closet size, and I get it, so I try to show what I can. Something I love about this house is the really tall ceilings, and it still feels very new. You can also see a few things like this um, that has the, uh, that's a, it's like a jack, basically. It's an open air jack that makes it where, you know how whenever your air conditioner shuts down or uh, turns on, Sometimes it'll slam doors and stuff. Well, this actually equalizes pressure uh, between the bedroom and the outside of the bedroom, so that, that won't really happen. Here is the guest bathroom. We have a sink here as well. Nice tile floor in here. Um, there's carpet in the, the bed, bedroom areas, and it's in very good shape. Bedroom number two. Same size closet as the other one. I don't know if that's exact, but it's very close in size. All right, let's go see the hallway and the living room and kitchen. It's all very open as we go this direction. Before we go down there, let's take a look at this. It is a coat closet, storage space, could be a tornado room. And then continue. Notice the tile throughout in here. Looks very nice. Recessed lighting in the kitchen. Wide open windows out there as well. So there's this large living space. You have a breakfast or dining area over here. Another kind of uh, dining area there on that island. The countertops are granite and these black appliances really go with that really nicely. Mm -hmm. Cabinetry, you have 42 inch tall cabinets. Very nice. And the recessed or undermount sink, stainless steel. A lot of people want to see the pantry, so let's go ahead and take a look. There you go, very nice. And this does have its own laundry room. There's a humidity fan in here as well, which is good for helping your clothes dry. Just beyond that door is a two-car garage. It's loaded with the seller's items right now, but she's moving all of that out. So there's the door to the backyard. And here is the primary bedroom. It is considerably larger than the other rooms. Our closet has, you know, stuff that you put in a closet, clothing and other items. But it is large, it is tall. I, if it were me, I might add um, another storage, well, just a rack up top, you know, for seasonal clothing. This house does have an alarm system built in. Um, of course, has fire smoke alarms. Here's the primary bathroom. So you have two double sinks. It is another um, granite or stone type sink material, or I'm sorry, the, cap, the countertop material. There's some customized um, hardware. It's just very nice. Um, very clean, very nice. We've got a toilet area. You have a stand-up shower. And then a so soaking tub, which is very big. And here's a view of the backyard here. Let's just go see it in person. So the cellar <clears throat> had all of this stone put in, as well as this really nice pergola 